we live in a world where the affairs of the world are around us all the time. There's gain, there's gain, there's loss, there's status, loss of status, praise, criticism, pleasure, pain. And if, you know, if we allow these things to make inroads on the mind, we're going to be in bad shape because they keep spinning around. If we go running after them, we start spinning around too to the point where we get dizzy and we don't know what's north or south, east or west. In other words, we don't know what's right or wrong. So to not follow these things, we need two things. One is the right understanding. In other, in other words, understanding that what the world does to you doesn't matter. It's what you do that matters. You have to be very firm in that belief, firm in that understanding, that it's your actions that make all the difference in your life. And the other is strength of mind, because sometimes we know it should be done, but we don't have the strength to do it. And that knowledge just goes to waste. One of the reasons we practice concentration is to develop strength of mind, so we can have an inner source of food. It's like having a city that's being attacked by the enemy. If we have gardens in the city, okay, we can survive. We have our own independent source of food. So you develop that food with a concentration, and then you use that strength together with your understanding to deal with the problems that come up. Some people like to think that all I have to do is sit in, con in concentration for a while and the problems in my mind will go away. It doesn't go away, it's just concentration. <coughs> You've got to use your discernment as well. This is one of the reasons why we listen to the Dharma and read the Dharma, to pick up strategies that may have not occurred to us otherwise. And we take those strategies and we adapt them to fit with our lives, and in adapting them we develop our discernment too. So what, what began as someone else's strategies become our strategies. What was other people's discernment becomes our discernment. So when problems come up, make sure you've got both of these qualities working for you, both the understanding and the strength of mind. As they work together, they'll see you through. <laughs>